Welcome to Ladybug Testimony, Scorpios. How you guys doing today? This will be astrology advice, um, looking into the mental space, the heart space, um, the, men, uh, the overall energy, which you don't know, most likely outcome, and of course, spiritual advice. We are dealing with the Gemini moon, um, with Gemini season, so there's a lot of communication going on, improving communication skills, listening, thinking, and also speaking. We are we are moving into, so it's important, important decisions being made. Gemini, Virgo, and Sagittarius, and Pisces, you will be affected the most, so take it easy. We are moving into a Cancer moon, June 4th. Um, and Mercury is also in Cancer, June 4th until the 26th. So information is coming in. It's going to be pretty heavy, pretty deep. Um, a quote I took from CafeAstrology.com. Our thoughts are colored by our emotions, so it's more challenging to be objective. Okay? So take your time. Clear your mental space. Get things together that you need to get together here. Meditate. Some of you need to apologize, Scorpios. What's going on, water signs? I would like to ask the universe for peace, for love, for balance, for protection. Insight. I would like to thank the universe for balance and protection and love, creativity, acceptance. Love and light in Jesus' name. There could be some apologies coming in, for sure. We'll be in Scorpio by next Thursday. Not this Thursday, but on the 13th of this month, we'll be in Scorpio. So, some emotions are coming. The overall energy for you, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more insight. We can dig a little deeper. I can help with things also for connections i offer a couple of things um the description box will help what's the overall energy for you guys please take what resonates and leave what doesn't mm, we just had this the ten of cups so the energy is very happy, complete, new cycle starting, new emotions here. Okay, Scorpio. Trusting your intuition could be dealing with the Pisces, Cancer. The mental conflict for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Taurus is still in Venus. So... Family issues are big right now. The mental conflict for Scorpios is just not really dealing with anything. Sitting back, you know, you feel like things are coming in. So you're not too worried here. You're satisfied. You know what I'm saying? Dealing with things as they come. Blocking out anything else. A lot of signs have been doing that. If it doesn't feel good, you're blocking it out. You're trying to. And a lot of you are getting yourselves together. But Scorpio overall looks like you're pretty positive. Some of you are too positive. But you ain't really letting anything get to you. On your heart space, Scorpio, sun, moon, and rising. There's a lot of emotions here. You're putting things to rest. Not really dealing with too much. You know what I'm saying? Like if it, if it don't make you feel good, you ain't dealing with it. But you do have something that you need to deal with. You're just not dealing with it right now. You're trying to stay positive. You're getting rest, putting connections um, on hold here. Just stand positive. What you don't see is this Sagittarius energy coming in, this fiery energy coming in. Could be a celebration here. Some of you have friends coming in, coming in to drink and to celebrate. Okay, could have a couple of dancers coming in. Okay, that's a good time. That's a good time. Some of you are even going swimming. Okay. That's nice. Food outings. Okay. 
All right. Most likely outcome for Scorpio. Sun, moon, and rising. Also, a third party situation, even though it's not clarified just yet, I do feel like that's coming in as well. Some of you could be offering a third party situation, offering to celebrate with somebody, just a crowd of people. You could be getting uh, parties together, Scorpio, so maybe family events here. Scorpio sun here, we have the emperor with this Aries energy. You are determined to go after what you want here. Some of you know what you want. Some of you know what makes you happy. And you're very direct about it. You could be watching somebody. You have your eyes set. Like you you know what you want to do. You know where you want to go. You know what makes you happy. You know you want where you want to take action at. <laughs> Some of you could want to come in and just rock somebody's world too. Okay, Scorpio. Scorpio, you are dealing, you're getting over things, you're healing for sure, getting ready for this new opportunity, Scorpio moon here, you're holding back, you're not really expressing too much, you're keeping a smile on your face, because you got somewhere to go, okay, you could also be fantasizing, that's why you're not taking action, because you're fantasizing, uh -huh. You know what you sent out into the universe. Okay. Scorpio rising. Oh, I need some water. You could be also, Scorpio, you could be waiting. Whew. Waiting to see what's coming in. Waiting to see this baby, waiting to see this opportunity blossom into what you wanted, you know, what you put out there. Some of you gotten somebody pregnant and you're just waiting to see the results come in. Scorpio rising, you could be putting this mental conflict down. You're not dealing with anybody. Like I say, if they want to fight, if they want to argue, you don't got time for it. You're even putting things to rest so you can get yourself together, so you can be mentally prepared for what's to come. Blocking out anything that doesn't mean you any good. You could be blocking out communication as well. So some of you are doing your own thing. Stand to yourself here. Making secret plans. Mm -hmm. Some of you are even blocking out a connection. Could be too strong. Too many people involved here. Some of you still need to heal. Could be dealing with the Scorpio. Scorpio things could be happening next Thursday, Scorpio. Okay. Be careful about this communication coming in. Because there is a situation coming in. And there's not a lot of majors here. So kudos to you. Somebody knows what they want to do as well, Scorpio. This could be you. The overall energy is the Ten of Cups. This new cycle starting. Somebody is rushing into this family situation. Rushing to see what they can do, how they can fix it. Could also be coming in to argue about the family situation. So, Scorpio, if you are the toxic energy, get it together. Some of you are just rushing in to spy on somebody's situation. And this may cause some pain for you, so be careful. The mental conflict is actually expressing yourself, going after this new offer. You could be so comfortable in your skin that you don't see something else manifesting. Somebody could, you could be just fantasizing, like I said. You really could be fantasizing. What's on the heart space is getting some rest. 
fantasizing. Just really in a dream world, really not taking action on anything. You want to rush in, but it's not like you want, want to stay. You could be dealing with a lot of people and not really knowing what to choose. What you don't know, though, somebody is really working hard. It could be Sagittarius energy. They could be working hard to ground themselves, get things together. Somebody could be planning a celebration as well, Scorpio. But there's a lot of satisf satisfaction here. You feel satisfied as all your wishes have been fulfilled. Your pleasure is natural and internal and self endowed So like you created this. You've manifested this. But you did not want to keep it. Or it's just a part of your plan. It was all part of the plan. Scorpio sun, you're very determined. You know what you want. You want to rush in and actually, you could, some of you want to rush in and take somebody from somebody. Okay. There's an opportunity here, Scorpio, period. Scorpio sun, moon, and rising, there's an opportunity coming in. You could get what you want. And that can go for a good thing and a bad thing. Some of you are dealing with this pregnancy, though. There's a pregnancy here. Some of you, what's on your mind is this new seed that you've planted. But there's most definitely an opportunity here. This is a period of profit, new opportunities, of profit, prosperity, <laughs> rewards to come, prosperous activities. Prosperous, goodness, gracious, trees, get it out. A commitment for sure. Oh my goodness gracious. I'll show you. But some of you know what you want. Some of you got your eyes, okay? Some of you are sitting back and some of you are ready to go forward. Sun, Scorpio, you're ready to go after this opportunity. Um, Scorpio Moon, you could just be sitting back and observing. Not really taking too much action. Scorpio Rising, we got this mental conflict. You can't make a decision on what you want to do. You don't know if you want to take action or walk away. Could be waiting to express some painful truth as well. Oh, let me show you what I saw. Some of you do need to make a decision on a third party situation. Sun, Scorpio Sun, you know what you want. You're ready to move forward towards it. <laughs> and Scorpio Moon, same for you. You see this opportunity. You just haven't gotten up and taken the, the chance to go after it. Strong Aries energy. A lot of determination. A lot of direct, uh, direct communication. And there's an opportunity coming. Scorpio Sun, creative blocks. If you are an artist of any kind, you can offer all work to the divine, making it God's alone. I offer this for the highest good to benefit the planet. Release me from any blocks and restrictions. May I serve all who need me. Yeah, there's a need to work together, to come together. You could be wanting to work with somebody to come together. Oh, that is so pretty. Watching somebody's videos, and that's why you know this is the opportunity to go towards, which is beautiful, Scorpio. Scorpio Moon, we have feelings. Okay, emotions want to be felt. You really can't surrender something until you deeply feel it. 
Allow me, dear divine, to offer all emotions to you, filling them fully so they can no longer hold me captive. Release, let things go, let this mental conflict go, okay? Get some rest. There's a celebrate. Somebody's working on something behind your back anyway that you don't know that's coming in. Scorpio, this could be you as well, which you don't know. Somebody is working really hard or this is going to take a lot of work. Also, you may not know that somebody works very well with other people. Scorpio rising. Patience. If I've if you've tried try forever to shift a problem, there's probably something to learn from embracing it. May I let this be for now? Help me relax and trust every need will be met. Often change soon follows. Change is coming. Be patient. Clear out things. Get some rest. Meditate. These videos are all over the place with the time. So no. Bottom of the deck says loneliness. I just wanted to clarify the Nine of Cups again. Somebody is done waiting, though, with the Seven of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody is done waiting and they know what they want. Could be a Sagittarius. The past is most definitely coming back. But they don't know how to get there, though. Just falling out. But they're gaining the strength. Strong Sagittarius energy. Somebody wants to go back to the past. Could be a past connection as well. And somebody is somebody has manipulated the situation and they're just waiting to see what happens, what's coming in after it. There's mental conflict on how to pursue this relationship, how to start something here. And some of you will just choose. It will be easier to say that you are just going to make the decision yourself. But when the universe instructs you, looks like you will listen to it. Follow your intuition, trust your intuition and go after what you want. Let go. So things can come in. Let this pain and this hurt go. All right. Send in love and light. Have a great day. The description box below will have all the links that you need to get towards me for, so I can help you with anything that's going on. But it looks like you have your mind made up. Nobody can really come in and tell you anything. The energies we do have, if you want to know, we have Pisces, Energy, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, Strong Aries. Gemini, Aquarius, and we don't go back into Aries until next month. Oh, no, on the 24th, like at the end of the month. So something could be, somebody could be making a decision by the end of the month, and that is on Monday. Those are decision-making days, huh? <laughs> Have a great day. Love and light. There's a lot of determination here. A lot of, you're satisfied. Alrighty, have a great day. Good night.